and motivator Speak nothing but the truth Tell them how my life was through My life was up and down That's why I'm speaking now Look at my YouTube page I'm gonna motivate you when you had them bad days Hey, 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 hey Hey, 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 hey it's your boy, J. Michael, with another V-I-D-E-O. Hit that subscribe button, that notification bell, the dislike, the like. I don't care how you feel, just keep it real. The real get less way. Hey, 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 hey. All right, this is going to be a real quick video because I've seen a couple of reactions on Cryer and Erica going to the carnival with the kids. All right, first off, somebody made a video and said, Erica and Cryer got the haters mad. Let them hate. First off, how can people be haters? Because they speaking on them? Help me understand this, people. Leave it in the comments. Help me understand this. Even the Cryer fans, the Erica fans, however y'all feel, I want to see how Help me understand how people are haters because they broadcast their life for everybody to see. If it's good or bad, people going to speak on it. You know, you got people that's going to be good, speak on them good. You got people that's going to be neutral that speak. Then you're going to be people that don't like them that's going to speak. So how can people be haters? Because everybody's not going to have the same opinion. Everybody's not going to see what they're doing as justified. Everybody's not going to see what they're doing as good. Some people gonna see it as games. Some people gonna see it as people just hating. Some people gonna see it as, you know, they, they still learning each other. You know, they, they got this type of relationship. You know, that's just Erica and Mr. Cryer. People gonna see the way they see it. So they can't be haters when you broadcast your life. That's not hating. See, like I said in a previous video, People can talk about whoever they want to talk about. They not hating. But as soon as you say something about Erica or Cryer, everybody's hating. People want to be like them. People clout chasing. Why people can't do other stuff? Why it's always about them? But the same people that say that, if you go to their pages, all their videos about Erica and Cryer or the Muckers or Latoya. So. How can they speak or talk about something when they're doing the same thing? Why you can't do nothing else? Why you can't speak on nothing else? Look at your videos. Go through your video log. Why you can't do nothing else? Or why y'all can't do nothing else? But y'all can speak on them. It's good because y'all talking good about them. So y'all not hating. Y'all just... We love Erica and Cryer, so yeah, we can talk about them. But y'all doing the same content. Majority of y'all videos is about them. Come on, help me understand this, people. It's not hating. You know, people don't want to see Erica fail. People don't want to see Cryer fail. But when y'all play this ping pong game, yo-yo game, ring around the rosy game, this back and forth green light, red light game, people gonna speak on it. People gonna give their opinion on why y'all playing these games with each other. One minute y'all love each other. Next minute y'all hate each other. Next minute y'all going to war. So what, you think people ain't going to talk about it? Come on, just, just, I'm, the thing is, y'all smart as hell. Because y'all know drama sales. Y'all know anything with y'all name attached to it, people going to watch because they want to know what Erica going to do next. They want to know what Cryer going to do next. And they watch Eric, they watch Latoya and Mucker because they want to see if they going to keep up the drama. Come on. 
people sitting back waiting for this soap opera. It's not hating. Come on. Y'all have fun. People want to see y'all have fun. People want to see y'all raise y'all kids right. People don't want to see y'all go down a down slide. Mr. Cry, you a half a century. Erica, you, you in your 30s. People want to see y'all thrive. People want to see y'all rise. But y'all y'all play these mixed emotions with everybody on YouTube. Y'all 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 play that manipulation game with everybody on YouTube. But y'all know y'all care about each other somehow, some way. I don't know how. What kind of relationship or bond y'all have? But y'all got to start setting examples for people. Or y'all trying to be like the TV show Dallas. Y'all trying to be like the TV show Dynasty or um, Atlanta Housewives. All that, all these TV shows, these reality shows that that had the drama, the friction. That's what y'all trying to make yourself like, where people, where y'all can be the bad guy and the good guy. That's how y'all, that's, that's, that's how y'all trying to play it and build it. You know, because the muckers and the, and the crier and, and, and Erica, all y'all throw little uppercuts and jabs at each other. I just sit back sometimes and watch then I speak on some things. But I watch all y'all. All y'all throw little jabs. All y'all throw little uppercuts. And then when some when one of y'all speak on it, everybody pointing the finger at I didn't do it. I didn't do it. He didn't do it. She didn't do it. Oh, uh, it was them. They started it. Uh-uh, it wasn't nothing. They threw the first shot. Y'all play the pointing game. And at the end of the day, all y'all grown folk. All y'all grown folk. That's trying to get money. That's trying to build a baby empire. One way or another. That's what y'all doing. Cryer, you too old, man. To be playing these carnival games. I mean, everybody happy that you, you being a dad. You being more active. People, people appreciate, I mean, they ain't gonna say appreciate that. People loving that. People loving that, man. But you have to sit back and really evaluate the, the situation because you know what I'm talking about. We ain't even gotta speak about it on the internet. Because you know that time gonna come. So you really gotta sit back and assess the situation. You see what I'm saying? And I ain't talking about no beef for those ignorant mind people out there. I'm not talking about no, I'm not throwing no threats for those ignorant mind, little mind people out there. Oh man, he threatened Mr. Cryer. Oh man. No, Mr. Cryer know what page I'm on. He know what I'm talking about when I say assess the situation because that time is coming. You see what I'm saying? And you already know about that situation. So, if you're going to be with this woman, and y'all going to be with together, and y'all going to love each other, and y'all going to raise them kids together, be together. Stop all the drama. Stop all the, the riffraff going back and forth. And as for Mucker, give that man a chance to be a father to his son. Sit back, stay out the way until you see that man do some wrong crier or that man start disrespecting again, then you step up. But give that man a chance to be a father to his son. Just like you being a father to baby Dion. 
Give that man that chance. Give that man the benefit of the doubt. You get what I'm saying? And as for Toya, you know, you got a lot of people saying she was she mad because of the baby. But it could have played both ways. If she wouldn't have had a miscarriage, she would have had a baby by you. Munker got a baby by Erica. So, any way it go, you could have said you had a kid by her, but the kid passed. Erica had hers. You had Latoya pregnant. He got Erica. He had a baby by Erica. You see, Sam? It's a lot going on between the four horsemen. A lot going on. But y'all have to wake up. Mucker, you're supposed to be this real estate mogul. So why would you have time to go back and forth and be petty? Be that real estate mogul. Crier, you done came from a long way on your YouTube. You ain't got to go back and forth and be petty. You ain't got to keep throwing subliminal shots. Because just because you don't say nothing direct, people that got intelligent minds or people that can recognize logic and pay attention to logic know you being sub subliminal slick. Just like Erica. Everybody knows she being subliminal slick. Ain't nobody hating. People just seeing what y'all present on YouTube. If y'all didn't present certain things on YouTube, people wouldn't speak about it. But long as people, long as people speaking good about y'all, y'all don't have no problem with that. But as soon as somebody say something negative about y'all or don't agree with y'all, now they hating. We are, we against them. Leave us alone. Everybody not going to say stuff good about y'all. So you just can't tell people that's speaking good about you. Oh, y'all can talk about it. But the ones that hating, y'all better leave us alone. Well, uh, y'all just hating. We trying to do our thing. Don't be hating because we, we doing good and we loving each other and building. Y'all can't feel like that. Y'all in the public's eye. Y'all for the world to see. So people going to speak. It's just up to y'all to ignore them and continue to do what y'all do in y'all life. And I had to learn that because I took everything what people were saying to heart. Like, oh, what, 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 okay, what, what? But I had to learn. People going to pass their judgment, right, wrong, or good, or bad, whatever. That's their opinion. You get what I'm saying? As long as they ain't very, very disrespectful, that's their opinion. Let them people have their opinion just like y'all have your opinion. Just like y'all speak on certain things. Y'all not above everybody. Y'all not above the law. Y'all didn't create YouTube. So y'all need to quit saying, oh, people eating off us. People was doing YouTube way before y'all. But like I said in the previous video, if y'all the hottest topic right now on YouTube, people gonna speak on it. So that don't mean people using y'all name to eat. Come on. You know, y'all put yourself on this high pedestal. But one day, y'all gonna get on the level on that level. And then y'all gonna see what everybody was talking about. The good, the bad, the neutral. Y'all gonna see all that. And y'all gonna be like, damn, we really was acting a fool. You know what I'm saying? All we had to do was pay attention to everything that was going on around us and get off that high horse. And we can do our thing. You know, People out there in the YouTube world, in them streets, 
some in the streets, some in the bushes, some in the alley. You know, them, them, them people, you can have a small channel, but speaking facts, speaking good news, speaking truth, people are not going to pay no attention to you because your channel is small. But if you a big platform, halfway big platform, y'all can say, y'all ate a doodle -doo sandwich. And they went, oh man, what kind of seasoning you put on that doodle -doo sandwich? Y'all can say, y'all dived up a building and landed on one hand. They were like, oh, what? They gonna believe everything y'all say because y'all a big platform. That's how, that's how these streets are. You know? That's just like the real world. A person can come in there with a suit and tie and another person will be right next to him with some saggy jeans and a t-shirt. Y'all gonna judge that man with the saggy jeans and the t-shirt and, and y'all gonna go straight to the dude with the suit and tie. But the dude with the t-shirt and the jeans on is the boss, the CEO. But y'all looked at him like he was like he was a thug or, or a gangster or, or a nobody because y'all was looking at the dude in the suit. Y'all prejudged the dude in the y'all prejudged the dude, y'all judged the book by his cover. You get what I'm saying? And the dude with the suit was coming to see the dude in the t-shirt and jeans. You feel me? So y'all got to stop believing these big platforms over the little platforms. A person can have 100 subscribers, 200 subscribers. That don't make they word less powerful than the person that got the big platform. That don't make they word less believable because they got a little platform. People that get big platforms ain't always right. People that got big platforms word ain't gold. Y'all got to stop that. And look at the logic. Assess, accessorize the situation. Quit, quit thinking with your heart, or 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 being that super fan. Like, oh no, man, y'all better, mm -mm, y'all, mm -mm, yeah, yeah, mm -mm. y'all better get off that. Quit thinking like that. And give them small channels a chance. Listen to them small channels. Pay attention to them. Because one day, that small channel gonna be a big channel. And then what y'all gonna do? Go over to that page like, oh man, I've been supporting you, yeah, woo woo. Oh, I've been supporting her, oh yeah, woo woo. You get what I'm saying? You have some people that's really working hard to get their subscribers and their views. You got people that's really striving to get authentic subscribers, study bought subscribers. They really put me in work. But then you got the ones that buy their subscribers. But them the ones y'all believe because they done bought them numbers. So they believable. Then compared to the one that's really putting in the sweat, the tears, crawling through the mud to get a fan base, to give y'all good content. So for them people that always think people hating on Erica and Mr. Cryer, ain't nobody hating on them. They just passing their opinion, speaking on what they see and what Erica and Cryer throw out there for them to speak on. Just like Mucker and Latoya. So people not hating on Mucker and Latoya, they just speaking what they see, right? So, Mucker and Latoya sneaky, we all know that. But Erica and Cryer not sneaky. Everybody hating on them compared to Erica and Mucker. Why is that? Huh? Why? Mucker and Latoya, we see them. We see them get caught in their lies and all that. But y'all catch Cryer and Erica in so many lies. But it's a misunderstanding when it comes to them compared to Erica. I mean, compared to Latoya and Mucker. 
I'm not justifying what Erica, I mean, Latoya and um, Muck are doing compared to Erica and Cryer because all of them throwing shots like I said. All of them playing Pac-Man games, Centipede games, Galactic games, Donkey Kong games. And they still going to have to intertwine with each other because of that baby. You know, some people say Erica, Latoya mad because Erica got a baby by Mucker. Who knows? We don't know her feelings. That can be true. It might not be true. We don't know. But all we know for a fact is they going to be seeing a lot of each other for 18 years because of that baby. So, y'all need to find a way to dead all this stuff and start working as co-parenting. Erica and Latoya, y'all ain't never got to speak to each other. Y'all ain't never got to see each other. But, but eventually y'all gonna run into each other because that's gonna be that man wife. So you can't get in your body because she gonna be around um, baby mucker. Baby D, baby Dion, I mean, Cryer is around baby mucker. So it's going to have to work both ways. Y'all going to have to balance that scale out. And y'all going to have to come to some type of agreement. Study this going back and forth, trying to embarrass each other, trying to, trying to put everybody dirt out there. It's time to, 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 to do what y'all doing to build y'all empires and raise those children. And again, people not hating on Cryer. People not hating on Erica. They just passing their opinion, giving their opinion. J. Michael out. Wow.